White-tailed deer will eat landscape shrubs if they have to, but this is not their first choice. Deer can cause significant damage to your environment by consuming shrubs and small trees, especially during the winter and other times of the year when natural food supplies are scarce. It's possible for plants to heal from seemingly superficial wounds, but if a tree or shrub has its bark totally removed, it may die. Evergreens, flowering shrubs, and other varieties are just a few options that deer aren't likely to eat. I've compiled a list of deer-proof bushes for your consideration. Number one, boxwood. Evergreens in the genus Buxus, commonly known as boxwoods, have broad leaves like deciduous plants but retain their foliage throughout the winter. Because of this, they are frequently used as hedges. They require little care beyond an annual pruning to keep their shape and eliminate diseased branches. Boxwoods have alkaloids that are unpleasant to the taste of deer. The sun or partial shade is fine for these plants, which may survive in USDA zones five through eight. Number two, arrowwood veiburnum. This shrub has white spring blooms and scarlet fall foliage and is resistant to deer. In ideal conditions, it can reach heights of up to 10 feet. The height of the shrub can be managed with annual pruning, performed after flowering has ended. Also, this shrub has suckers that must be cut off if you want to protect it from taking over a large area. Veiburnum dentatum, more commonly known as arrowwood veiburnum, is hardy from USDA plant hardiness zones two through eight. Number three, bluebeard. The caryopteris shrub, often known as bluebeard or blue mist, flowers late in the summer when few other shrubs are in bloom. Many different kinds of pollinators enjoy this drought resistant shrub. The deer avoid the plant because of its strong odor, although the blossoms are attractive to bees and butterflies. Reduce the plant by half in the early spring to preserve it well-shaped and blossoming. Cut away any rotting or unhealthy branches. The optimal growing conditions for Bluebeard are zones five through nine. Number four, Russian sage. Pirovskia atroplicifolia sometimes known as Russian sage, is a sub shrub that features bluish blooms and silvery gray foliage. It can withstand dry conditions and won't attract deer. The plant grows by sending out subterranean runners and needs little care beyond occasional pruning. Russian sage can survive in USDA plant hardiness zones five through nine. Number five, butterfly bush. The butterfly bush, or Buddleia davidii, is an invasive species in many areas, but it also makes a beautiful landscape addition when used appropriately. These flowers attract pollinators like bees and butterflies, hence their common name, although deer typically stay away from them. They are also low maintenance. If you want a compact bush with more blossoms, pruning is recommended. In early January, some gardeners even cut the stems to the ground for a more streamlined effect. This is hardy from zone five to nine. Well, thanks for watching video from Catchy Garden. Don't forget to click like and subscribe button to always support our channel. You can also turn on the notification bell to get the latest videos from us. We'll see you in the next videos.